Hello everybody, welcome back to another live stream once again. It is Sunday night, it is a little bit later than usual on Sunday night. <laughs> but I'm here. I'm here, okay, don't judge me too bad. I know, I'm late. But, I just put out a video saying about all the updates and all the things I'm going to do. And one of those things I mentioned was about streaming and trying to be consistent. So, I was looking at the clock and I was thinking, oh no, I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Uh, and I didn't make it, but instead of just giving up altogether, I'm just here a little bit later on. Um, and it might just be a little bit of a shorter stream. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, I thought, let's not waste any time. Last week, we played some Broken Sword 4, and we made some good progress, I feel like. We we headed to Rome uh, with Nico. We spoke to Brother Mark. We spoke to the crazy uh, Lord Tramp guy. And then we went to Vatican City. And that's where things sort of ground to a halt. So if I do recall correctly, um, the end of last live stream, I said, you know what? I'm not going to cheat now. I'll cheat next time. So I'll cheat at the top of the next stream. And then that could be my cheating over and we can continue from there. Rather than just being stuck in Vatican City for far too long. We haven't got all day here. So, um, Mandy Cat, hello, welcome. I've been waiting all day. Well, you know what? I'm here for you then. Because uh, like I was just saying, very, very, I could have very easily just said, oh, no stream tonight. But no. No. And I'm glad I'm here. <clears throat> so, yeah, let me, let me load up Broken Sword 4, walk through. Obviously, I'm only looking at the bit that I'm talking about now. I'm not going to cheat further ahead. That's no fun. Um, also, I might be... I'm very sneezy today. So, I might need to mute a lot to uh, <clears throat> to sneeze. Okay. Oh my god, how old is this guide? I thought you'd never be back. You'd left us behind. No. Dennis, I would never leave you. And I know that you'd never leave me in these times of Broken Sword where I need you. I need you. He's late and starts cheating. This guy's a... If you didn't know by now, I'm the biggest phony there is. Phony and proud. I've got a t-shirt that says that. Okay, here we are. Part three, Rome. So, uh, we did all this stuff. We did the balcony. You can't see any of this, but I'm just reading a guide. Uh, Anna Maria's apartment did that. Did the, the Vatican. Here we go. Here we go. So. <laughs> I I haven't got any milk. Well, I've got... Actually, I guess I have, technically. I've got a cup of tea in which there is some milk. So, listen, I did go out and get some milk, but I'm back with it. I ain't gonna leave you behind. And it's far too hot. Okay, so... I'm just reading this bit about the Vatican. Um, da -ba -da -ba -da -da. This is the place from the photo of Anna Maria dressed as a nun. Yes, we know that. There was the gate in the background of the, the funny looking guards. Um, yep, Sister Serena answers the door. We did that. Look at the window next to the door. It's a small office. Look at Sister Angelica. Yes, she's the grumpy one. Can't do anything. Walk left a few steps and you can see the guards. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, there's actually no... Wow. There's actually nothing we could do in that situation right now. <laughs> it says, uh, once you learn about the Holy Order of St. Michael's, which we did, we learned that they made the wafers, ring the bell next to the covent door, talk to Sister Serena and work through the conversations. That's all you can do here at the moment. Head down and walk right to the map. Go back to Anna Maria's apartment. So there I was struggling for ages. And I couldn't even do anything. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Well, let, let's, let's, where is the game? Here is the game. There it is. I'm positively fuming. Can you tell? So we came back to the street. 
Like I said, it was not logical. Right. Oh, yeah. I wonder if this guy's... Is this guy's head still broken? His beard is, is separate to his face now. Hello again, Archie. Uh, can you spare a minute? For you, Georgie, my good fellow. Nothing. I, I mean, uh, oh. anything. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It is? Oh, that's still definitely broke. Oh dear. Max, hello. Testing, testing. Uh, right, so. Let's go back to Anna Maria's apartment. <laughs> Broken head four. The Adventures of Archie. Archie meets Lady Piermont. They fall in love. Then she cheats. He cheats on her. And she kills him. Hello, Max. Welcome. Right. <clears throat> We're back in the apartment with the soppy... The soppy music. Let's read some books, maybe. I'm not in the mood for light reading just now. Okay, so by I've the way... i got to find out what happened to Anna Maria. I did not read any more about what to do. I only read that we need to come back... To Anna Maria's apartment. That is all. Anna Maria must have been reading this before she left. I promise you. Anyway, how we all been? Can we log on to her computer now? The thing's got few capabilities. Not much I can do with it. I hope... I hope you would have seen my update video. Lots of, lots of things to talk about in that one. All my posts. I kind of spammed it everywhere, to be honest with you. Just because, uh, yeah, I felt like I had a lot to say in that one. Um, good stuff, too. Well, I think it's good anyway. <gasps> the Holy Bible. A little light bedtime reading, I see. So maybe Anna Maria is a nun. What have I done? I've already I've already seen all this. What, what did I... I must have missed something. But wait a minute. We have the photo. I don't know. We can turn on the tap. I was thinking, do we need to wash away something to reveal a secret message? Or maybe... <gasps> Wait a minute! Get it all steamy in here. Turn on that one. And then look in the mirror. Or look in this mirror. <laughs> okay, so my thought process there was that there was a message written in the mirror and you'd have to steam it up to see it. You know, like in all the films. It's like a film thing. Ah, oh, yes, the Right Honourable and Viscount Lord Archie Lonsdale, my new favourite character. Well, I'm sure we'll talk to him again. Uh, that's why I was waiting. You're finally back to streaming on a day I can actually watch. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear. Sunday, um, I think Sunday will be all right. I, I usually don't have plans Sunday. This week was a little bit different, but. Throw Nico in the shower. We well, like that, wouldn't you, Dennis, you pervert? <laughs> uh, I think there's a couple of you in chat that would like that. Uh, say Nico three times. Never. Wash Archie to reveal a secret message in his beard. <laughs> we need to sponge bath him. Like that hobo on the train in The Simpsons. Okay, I'm going to, I do think there's something to that shower though, like why can we turn that on? Why can we turn that on, eh? Maybe I should just talk to Nico. Where's she gone? Oh, she waits outside, doesn't she? Hey. Hey. Hey, Nico, can you give me a hand? What do you need, George? So, what do you think is going on, Nico? You really want to know? Sure. Well, at first I thought you'd been conned into helping some kind of robbery. And now? Now I think it's worse than that. Oh, I think we heard this Now before. I think you're caught up in some kind of conspiracy. Illegal shipments, fraud, or worse. Hmm. Last time I asked you for good news. 
How is Nico doing herself? Are those books interesting? Oh, we already asked well, this as well. They are very technical. You know, Georges, things just don't add up. I don't think we need to go out here because the guide did specifically say to go to the. No, nope. Park's apartment just doesn't yeah. interest me. To go to the apartment, not just the. Her apartment, not just the apartment block. So there must be something in here that I'm missing. But. It must be something we can now. What would we have got from that trip to the Vatican that we can now use going forward? It's going to be knowledge about this. Um, Holy Grail of St. Mark's or whatever it's called. Um, but we don't really have... Wait, did she give us... Did she give us something, Sister Serena? She didn't, did she? No. I thought maybe we could look it up on the computer or in some books, perhaps. Let's look in the kitchen again. Anything to eat? I'm kind of hungry. It must be... It must be a dialogue option. That's the only thing I can think of. That's the only thing that could have possibly changed. Unless... Use that on that? <laughs> I am not going to do that. No. A simple but beautifully crafted Italian clock. There's going to be something in the clock. Damn it. I thought I could maybe interact with it. I'm not in the mood for light reading just now. I've got to find out what happened to Anna Maria. Hmm. Books on religion, science, history. Aspects of heavy metal transmutation. Interesting. But how's that going to help us find her? How are you saying that? Nico, how are you even saying that? You're not even in the same room. That Nico is a creepy one. Lonely kitchen with only one chair. Well, she is a nun. Or is she? Hmm. Okay. Um. Do I do I just do I tab out and back into that? guide do i do it if it's really not logical then i'm just not going to get it am i i am a very logical person i've been watching star trek i consider myself i think i even look a bit like a vulcan actually i reckon i could have been a vulcan um i like them but not that much Although I don't, I don't have as good eyebrows. I, I need to get my eyebrows shaped, threaded. I don't know. The eyebrows are lacking, but I think everything else I can do the, I can do the live long and prosper, Vulcan salute. I can. Data. I could be data. I love data. I watched a really good episode the other day called Data's Day. Oh my goodness. I know I talk about Star Trek TNG every episode, uh, every live stream, but season four, every episode has just been such a banger. Um, Episode called Data's Day, so good. It's just like a, d a day in the life of Data, and it's really, really good. I keep saying it's good. Why it's good? Because you sort of see little strands of things going on board the Enterprise D. You get some very good acting, actually, by Brent Spiner. He is a very, he's very good. Like the things that he does as Data, you don't necessarily pick up on straight away, but when you do, you. There's actually a lot of nuance to the way he performs. Um, and what was the other thing I liked? Very, and actually quite funny. Not always very, not always a very funny show, TNG. But that one was. He's, he's a good comedic actor, and there's a good scene he does with uh, Beverly Crusher dancing. Anyway, end of review. Let's, let's cheat. Let's cheat. Oh, I need to, oh, for goodness sake, I need to hack into the bloody Vatican. I always forget about that phone.
Right, okay, I need to use the phone. That's the thing I just, I constantly forget about this silly PDA and the hacking minigame stuff. Right, connect. I found the Vatican server. Wow, how's about that? Right, here we go, folks. Oh. Dramatic music starts. But you have to be in the apartment for it. Oh, I see. So it's like, maybe when... Maybe if... Let's just assume COVID has happened and Anna Maria has had to do some remote working during a lockdown. So she would be connected via some sort of VPN to the Vatican computers. That's why you have to be here. I, I think that makes sense. I like that, that reasoning. Okay. Split there. Or actually, do I want to split there? No, split there, because then I'm getting that. No, no, don't split there. That's pointless. I actually, I like these as well. I like these puzzles. I just wish I remembered they existed. If Nico's parents gave her first name, what do they call their son? Nike. <laughs> Nico and Nike, or Nike. Nico and Nike. Right, so. Maybe actually we do this one. That makes more sense to me. Yes. And then reflect up there. Bend it like Beckham that way. I was thinking about that film earlier. For some reason. Bend it like Beckham. Oh my god, you can... <gasps> I didn't even know you could do that. Look at this, everyone. Can I zoom in? No, that's asking for too much. Right, how on earth am I going to get them over there? I think I've done this completely wrong. Completely. Oh, this is so wrong. I think actually, I reckon this is a converging... I reckon this is a converging one, rather than a diverging one. When will you stream Go Go Beckham Adventure? What? Go Go Beckham Adventure on Soccer Island. Oh, this actually looks quite good. I'm not, not going to lie. Hang on a minute. Look at this. I always forget which... Oh, it's that one. There we are. Go Go Beckham Adventure on Soccer Island, 2002. Oh, that David Beckham. Beckham can use his football in order to collect... Amazing. Mostly positive reviews. 75%. It does look like Super Mario World, you're right. Wait, there's a Spice World game as well? Hang on. <laughs> Spice World. The, I know Spice World had... Listen, did you know this? Let me show you. This is... I always bring this up whenever I, I talk about... Uh, Spice World. It had Roger Moore in it. Look at him. Hmm. Spice World, the game. <gasps> oh, they look like brats, like the dolls. Oh, that's hideous. What have they done to you, Baby Spice? Oh, <laughs> I actually kind of want to see this now. Why are the pictures so tiny? There we are. 
I was reading about Jerry Halliwell's. You guys are bringing up everything that has been on my mind recently. How, how is this happening? I was I was reading about Jerry Halliwell just the other day. Oh, it's because I saw a video of her and Kylie Minogue. That was it. All right, anyway, I'm getting sidetracked here. Let's finish this stupid puzzle. Okay, so how is this going to work? How am I going to get it over there? I think... I actually think maybe I was on the right track with this idea. Hang on. Oh, there we go. That's better. And then this one. There we are. This is it. We are not real. We are just AI generated comments from your phone. That would add up, actually. Chat GPT, GPT version 6. All right, so that goes up there. Then let's reflect it. That Oh, this is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. And then we... I don't know. I feel like this is a really good start, though. Um, we have one down here. Oh my god, I think I've done it. I actually quite like this music. What have I missed? I've missed something, haven't I? Oh, it's because it's... right. Oh, bugger. Can I not use... does it all have to be... point? like, does it all have to go somewhere? It can't just be... Going out into no like nothing. Now you're giving me an existential crisis. Uh oh. There's there's probably some crazy, uh, chat. Um. Twitch chat. AI scripts and functions and stuff now i don't know i feel like you could do some really wacky stuff with them um, if twitch allows it i don't actually know but um yeah like uh redemptions and stuff like that <laughs> so yeah what nico nico nike and nokia what a beautiful family and their pet is literally a nokia phone it's just a phone. All right, wh why is this not working? Is it because of this one up here? I don't know how I could fix that. Yes, I do. Oh, no, that doesn't work that way. Oh, damn it. Holy moly, what's going on now? Okay, this is... No, that's completely wrong. That's completely wrong. I've, had, I've, I've been pretty good with these so far. I, I don't want to give up now. Okay, what am I what what am I doing here? What is this? Hmm, this is not the one. I thought this was a great start, but it's well, that's not going to work either. Unless I do something more like that. Nope, that's not going to work. It would work there, though. Oh, oh, hello. Hello, wait a minute. That was also pretty good. I 
Except not really, because I'm still stuck in... Mm. Damn you, hacking phone. I'm just going to start again. Okay, what makes more sense to do? That one? Or the T-junction one? I think this one. <gasps> oh, oh, hang on, hang, wait a minute now. Wait a, wait a gosh darn second here. What is going on here? This is such a waste, though. And actually, that's not going to work, because then I can't... Hmm. What about if I had one of these little spinny ones? I mean, maybe that... Does it let me do that? Or does it have to all connect? Not that one. Uh, this one. See, I think that should count. But why isn't it? Is it because it has to go through them? It has to go through them. It can't just stop at them. Am I going to have to cheat again? I do not want to spend the whole stream on this minigame either. Tonight shall be the cheat stream. And you will like it. I hereby decree. Up. Rotate. What about this one, though? Oh, oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. <gasps> and then rotate that. No, that's not going to work either. That works though. That's pretty good. Hang on. Uh, maybe not that one. <gasps> Wait. Wait. No. Guess I could put that there as well. Does that help? Actually, that... <gasps> Wait, do I, how many do I have spare? I have none spare. Oh, no, I have this one. That's not going to get me around, though. Oh, all right. Cheating time. I think you're right, Mandy. Let's just get on with this. Let's see how far off I was. Oh, I was so far off. Hang on a minute. Oh, wow. I Yeah, the whole splitting thing was not the right way to go. Well, not down there anyway. More like there. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's actually quite clever. Okay. goes there. That one 
one goes there. Angle it. Oh. Right. Okay. I, I, I probably would. I probably would have got that, but in maybe half an hour. Uh, phone number requested for Sisters of Mercy Wafer Factory. Downloading info. Got it. The number for the wafer factory is 0039-06-6981-5956. Okay. Let's go. So I started watching... Um, I started re-watching Futurama. Futurama is now going to be my new dinner time uh, TV show. It used to be Bob's Burgers. Well, actually, going back, it used to be... It used to be um, Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Then Bob's Burgers, which loved. Big Bob's Burgers fan. Um... But then eventually we caught up, and even though it's still going, I'm, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna wait for it just to all be out as a season, and then watch it that way. Um, then we went back to Friends for a bit. But I've, I, I figured let's give Futurama another go, go. <clears throat> because then I can eventually get caught up and then watch the I new think episodes. I'll go to the Vatican. And let me tell you something. I was unsure whether. Futurama would have the same issue that The Simpsons has, where it, it takes a little while to get into it. Like, it takes a little while to get good, like properly good. It really doesn't. It's kind of crazy. Like the first, where are we up to now? The first five episodes. They're they're so strong. I could not believe how funny these. Like the moment they go to the moon, it's so good. It's just jam packed. I kind of. Forgot how good Futurama was. Um, all right. So we know the phone number. So let's ring him and distract Angelica. Excuse me. Waffer. Shouldn't be right in front of her, probably. Calling the wafer factory from here isn't going to work. Oh. Wouldn't take a genius to figure out it's me calling. Right. Yeah, don't do not do it straight in front of the window. Maybe over here? Um, I would like to speak to a Sister Angelica of the Sisters of Mercy, please. Certainly. Who may I say is calling? It's Brother Angus from St. Peregrine's, please. Just one moment, please. Sister Angelica, phone call. Go. Go, Georgie. That's it, you walk away. Give me that. It's her schedule for the day. Hmm. Looks like the health inspector's coming. Here she is. Time to put this back where I found it. Hello. Oh, we can actually leave now. Can we? Hey. Oh, we could try talking to her. Season one has some great episodes, but I Roommate is one of my least favourite. Always skip it on rewatches. Really? That's one that... We, yeah, I just watched that one the other day. Um, I do think that... Uh, Fry is very annoying in it. But what I'd like to know why, why is it one of your least favourites out of interest. I do think it gets stronger after the first season. Oh, no doubt. No doubt about it. But I was just impressed with how good the first season was. Or at least the amount that I've watched of it so far. Hello, Sister Angelica. You 
again. What is it this time? Mm-hmm. Right. My name is Henry Steiner, and I am the health inspector. But, uh, um, y you're not due to arrive until tomorrow. They fall for it every time. Um, this is highly irregular. We're not ready. You're supposed to be always ready. Let's see what your boss has to say. No, wait. <laughs> I'm sure it's all right. Um, come to the door at the side and I'll let you in. <laughs> Thank you so much, sister. You should really ask for some ID, Sister Angelica. That's the smart thing the to do. The Sisters of Mercy welcome you, Mr. Steiner. You're in luck. We're just about to run a batch. My assistant, Sister Serena, will give you the tour. The complete tour, I hope? No exceptions? Of course. Follow me, please. I'd better keep Herr Steiner going till I can find a way through this place and into the monastery. This factory has been the center of wafer production in Rome for nearly 80 years now. In 2000, we decided to automate the process, hence the Communion Companion 5XLI. Oh, wow. The Communion Companion 5XLI? Why, yes. Carry on. This machine has revolutionized our wafer production process and maximized output. First, the wafer ingredients are fed into the mixer to make the dough. The dough is then fed along the conveyor and into the cutter. From the cutter, the biscuits are... Stop! Oh. You said biscuits. I mean wafers. Yes, you do. Carry on. Oh. Anyway, the wafers are transferred to the ovens for baking. From the oven, they are cooled in the fresh air. Then the wafers are packed, ready for delivery all over the globe. Thank you for visiting the Sisters of Mercy, and enjoy your stay in our beautiful city. Okay. This is all rather strange. Why did we pick a German <laughs> accent? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> a German could never lie. Plot feels very sick on me and basic. The writing isn't there yet, so not all that funny either. It just feels out of place for Futurama. Oh, okay. My favourite character from that episode is the old lady. The old lady landlord. Oh, that's a jigger. I can relate to her. She reminds me of some family members. <laughs> <So> <laughs> all right, what do we have over here? That pile of boxes is a health hazard. All it needs is one person to knock them over and there'll be wasted wafers everywhere. Please, make sure they're safe. Of course, I'll check them now. Serena's tidying the boxes. She's not interested in me for the moment. Okay, eat the wafers. It's a half-packed box of communion wafers. I don't want this one. <laughs> We're just gonna let her do that. <laughs> You're right there, love. Right, so we got a wafer. Please don't touch those, Mr. Steiner. Oh, what are they for? You never know when a church might run dry of wafers or wine. But surely they should be prepared for the communion. Anything can happen. Flash flooding, fires. Acts of God. Exactly. Where's the wine? Give me the wine now, sister. I ain't joking. Uh, George, are you gonna do anything? Please, that's sensitive machinery. Only Sister Angelica may touch the holy machine. And besides, you're not wearing your protective gloves. Aha! Very good. You're familiar with the Holy Cleanliness Handbook, I see. Oh, yes, sir. I have a copy of it next to my bed. Really? You do? Uh, I mean, a gold star for you, my dear. Now, why can I not touch the machine without gloves? Because you'd get the machine dirty. True. But really, it's to avoid catching the parasites which inhabit the flower in the dough. Yuck! Is that the truth? 
My dear sister, who is the expert? You are, Mr. Steiner, sir. <laughs> Felt like we were enjoying this a bit too much. Take a wild guess as to what you end up doing here. Oh, no. Say it ain't so. There is a lot of, a lot of box-shaped things in this factory, isn't there? Oh, I like the kind of heat. Heat face. Wait, George, where are you going? I, d I, d what? I clicked here. Oh. <gasps> what is this? No, you mustn't do that. It could contaminate the whole batch. I knew that. I was just testing you. Thank goodness. If I ruined a whole batch, I'd be exiled to some distant diocese for life. Let contamination be your enemy, sister. George has been inspired by Dr. Kaufman, yeah? <laughs> he does sound like him, actually. <laughs> oh, what does that mean? What does that mean for Sister Serena, though? Get out, sister. What's in here? Uh oh. Going somewhere, Mr. Steiner. Double check everything. That's my motto. Not down there, I'm afraid. Papal permission is required to enter the monastery. Not even the Pope himself can stand in the way of health and safety. I think you'll find he can. Goodbye. Oh, God, if I could only get rid of her. Kill her. No, wait. Th that's rude. Tie her up. Who is this Pope guy, anyway? Why do you think he's such a big deal? Pope Schmope. Right, what did we get? We got the wafer, didn't we? Communion wafer. Hmm. I'm going to get her to struggle with the box. Then I'm going to go up and contaminate... Everything. Oh no. No, 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 no. It fell that again. still won't do. Look how easily I can tip the boxes over. I'm sorry, Mr. Steiner. I'll get right on it. The lives of the innocent are in your hands, my dear. Yeah, it's wrong. But it feels so good, too. Right, go, go, go. Go. Go, George, run. Leave that silly sister. I hope she's carrying and picking up with her legs. Not her back. Okay, contaminate everything. Sister Serena is watching me like a hawk. Or a malevolent robin. I have to distract her somehow. What? Sister Serena is watching me like a hawk. How is she? Or a malevolent robin. I have to distract her somehow. She was so far away. Push her into the machine. Damn. Can I distract her with anything else that takes longer? What's through here? I don't see the point in leaving when it took me so long to get in. Oh. Wait a minute, do we have a banana peel anywhere? No. Uh, what can I talk to you about, sister? Oh, wow, all these machines. So interesting. What should we learn about first, folks? The mixing vat, the cutter, the ovens, or the cooling station? Or the Holy Order of St. Mark itself? Uh, all right. So how does this place connect to the Holy Order? Oh, the factory backs onto the Holy Order's grounds. This building is just used for wafer production. So can monks from the Order come in here? Monks? Heavens no. We are very strict about visitors. The only people allowed in here are cardinals and bishops. And nuns, of course. We have a strict cleanliness policy. 
Good. And how are the mixing vats cleaned? Oh, you're like this. Every week we hold a competition, and the winning nun gets to climb in with a scara. Hmm, but wholesome fun that must be. These cutters, what precisely is your cut-to-death ratio? What? The relationship between cutter operation aggregates and notifiable fatalities. Oh, um... Are the cutters safe? Oh, yes, they're safe. They're safe? Very safe. Are they safe? Um, well, no. No? No, they're not safe. They're not safe? No. They're dangerous. Dangerous? Very dangerous. So they are not safe? No, they're not safe. Not safe at all. I see. But are they safe? Oh, my God. Yes. They're very safe. They are safe. <laughs> oh, yes. Very, very safe. Good. Simple question. Simple <laughs> answer. That's all I needed. This poor girl, we are torturing her. Oh, what is this conversation? I don't know. These ovens, do you ever cook pizza in them? Mm. What? I just wondered. I would, if I were you. Well, we don't. They are for the holy wafers, not pizzas. Good answer to a trick question. Never drop your guard, sister. Oh, you know what? I was just thinking back to it. When I went to Italy last year, oh... I had the bet. Do you know what? You know what? I wish they did in at least here in the UK more often. In fact, at all. I've I've not seen it. I guess I just haven't been to the right pizza place yet. White pizzas. Oh. I had the best white pizza. Um. Where was it? I can't remember whereabouts it was now. But oh my goodness me, who needs tomato-based sauce? Give me the creamy. Give me the creamy stuff. Oh, and it had pesto on it. Oh, it was brilliant. I'm making myself hungry. This cooling area, would you eat your dinner off it? Certainly not. Aha, not clean enough, eh? No, of course not. It's for wafers. But would you lick it? Mr. Steiner, lick it? Yes, sister, lick it. Would you? No. Very good. Outrage 9 out of 10. Excellent score. They are the best. Simply the best. R.I.P. Tina Turner. So how do you enter the Holy Order from here? There is just one exit, via the rear entrance. But Sister Angelica keeps a careful watch on the door. You never know who might walk in. Yes, good thinking. Cleanliness must never let down its guard. All right, well, thank you very much for that, Sister Serena. And sorry George is being okay. such a jerk. Thanks, Sister. But you got to do what you got to do. So that isn't a big enough distraction. I think what we need to do is mess up one of the machines. And that will get what's her face coming out of here. Sister Angelica. But. She's watching me like a hawk, this one. Uh, What is the actual source? Hang on. I think it might be, uh... Well, that's a useless, a useless article. Here we go. I accept the cookies. I think it's just a cheese sauce. Yeah. Maybe similar to like a bet, what is it, bechamel? What is that? Is that what you use for lasagnas? Oh no, that's the one, no, that's not it. I can't remember what it's called, but it's nice. Okay, so. It's gotta be something to do with this. Oh, and also, why did we, why did we pick up this? Communion wafer from the Sisters of Mercy. Oh, do I need to stage stage it like something's gone wrong? Oh, 
What is this? Can you do something, George? The wafers are cooled on this tray as they emerge from the machine. That's good. It's very clean. Hmm. Maybe I'm getting into character a bit too much here. That is a sterile area, Mr. Steiner. Please don't touch the cooling bay. And how often is this wiped down? Before cooling commences and then directly afterwards. Hmm. Correct. These... These uh, sisters have got it good here. I'll, I'll give them that. I'll give them that. Wait, do I need to distract her with this one? No, 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 no. That still won't do. Look how easily I can tip the boxes over. I'm sorry, Mr. Steiner. I'll get right on it. And the then... lives of the innocent are yeah, in yeah, your yeah, hands, yeah. my dear. Yeah, it's wrong. But it feels so good, too. And then while she's doing that, then do I mess with that other box? Go. The box is firmly taped down. I'm not going to be able to open it quietly that way. Firmly taped down. Using that won't work. What does that mean? Firmly taped down. Hmm. It says on the side, emergency communion pack, wafers and wine. Emergency pack? Strange concept. Who'd run out of wafers and wine? Um, I, I think we have to do something with that. So we, we couldn't open it quietly because it's taped down. Could we slice it open? We have got a knife. Maybe that's what we need to do. Right, do this again. I really want pizza now. Yeah. No, 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 no. Good that Lord. That still won't do. Look how easily I can tip the boxes over. I'm sorry, Mr. Steiner. I'll get right on it. The lives of the innocent are in your hands, my dear. Yeah, it's wrong. But it feels so good, too. Right, go, 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 go. Out of wine sounds like an emergency to me. Code red. Wine. Not while Sister Serena's watching. She's not watching. She's not watching. She's got her back to us. Not while Sister Serena's watching. Oh, for goodness sake. That's dumb. That's dumb. Uh, right, so I guess I, I... I need to distract her with a machine instead. Did we look at this one round here? Let's look at this one. That oven is extremely hot, Mr. Steiner. Please be careful. I see no warning sign. It's not ready. Not ready? Not ready? We were expecting you tomorrow. Dear, oh dear. This will have to go down in my little book. Oh. Oh, indeed. Was there anything else up this way? No, just more conveyor belts. Okay, so maybe... Maybe I need to distract her with the box over there. Then maybe, like, there's no line of sight here. So surely we'll be safe to mess around here, even though it's hot. Do we have, like, a glove or something? <gasps> we have moldy bread. That wouldn't look good on a health report. Health and safety inspection. Can we place this somewhere and be like, what have you got here? Moldy bread in the factory? Do you have... Oh, do you have something fun in your inventory that you that could help? I'd say moldy bread is quite fun. Or maybe my salami. Oh, I do think we need to do... The moldy bread, the fact it's moldy is sticking out to me. It really is. But where could I pull it? Where could I put the mouldy bread as a... as a frame? Oh, Mr. Steiner, this is a clean area. 
Yes, I knew that. I was just checking you knew the rule book too. Maybe he? Are you in charge of this area? Yes. That's where I pack the wafers for dispatch. So this area is oh. a food-free zone? Yes. Yes, I never eat food in uh -huh. this area. Never? No, never. Never ever? No. Never ever ever. Hmm. We'll see. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Let's frame this sister. Let's put some moldy bread in there. That I think that was a, a good enough setup right there. That should be something in George's arsenal. He should always have a fake moustache on him. Along with the red panties, the um, clown nose, the snotty tissue. Everything. Okay, so push that. No, 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 no. That still won't do. Look how easily I can tip the boxes over. I'm sorry, Mr. Steiner. I'll get right on it. The lives of the innocent are in your hands, my dear. Yeah, it's wrong. But it feels so good, too. Very good. And then, while she's doing that and struggling away, moldy bread. In there. This will shake her for a while. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Sister Serena, could I see you here for a moment, please? What is that? Oh, my word. How on earth? I don't believe it. Section 12 of Bylaw 38B, Section C, clearly states that all areas for the packing of food must be kept separate from the areas of food consumption. I thought you said you never eat around this area. I don't know how... Well, it can't be... But I, I never... This is a clear violation. And the penalty for violations is severe. No wafers please, for you. Please, let me clean it up. I'll double check everything. I don't want to go back to polishing candlesticks. Ha! Polishing! You should be so lucky. We are talking prison here. Prison? Holy mother! Oh, do stop that ridiculous display. But I feel so guilty. And you are. <laughs> However... Yes? <laughs> if you ensure... There's not a scrap of food remaining. I might overlook the matter. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll get right on it. The place has to be spotless. Of course, of course. W will you be okay looking around on your own? Well, I shall just have to be. Fantastic. Now I've got the run of the place. Brilliant. Right, that's her off our back. Let's actually save right now. Save. Sister would never beat Broken Sword 3. So bad at box puzzles. I <laughs> uh, was wondering when you're going to be giving out the free PS5s. I want to be ready for the Mucklock Riots. I was reading about that earlier, actually. Um, well, I thought I'd do something a bit different. So I don't have the money for PS5s. Even though they have gone down in price, I spotted. Um, but what I am going to do for all you special fans out there in the chat right now, I have hidden and in a boxed it actually is boxed in original packaging a boxed Nintendo Wii somewhere in Hyde Park go no but I actually, yeah, I, I went to see my mum today and I picked up some stuff and one of them was I found, <laughs> I found uh, the box for my Wii, <laughs> so I packed it all away. Um, no, I don't really need a Wii. I got a Wii U. I can play the games on that, and they look better. But it's still good to have. And I, and I got my Wii Balance board as well. Does it come with Wii Sports? No. Don't get greedy. <laughs> Bye, Dennis. Uh, and it does come with, what was in the box? Two controllers, three Joy-Cons, paperwork. Um, that was about it. But I need to give it a good old clean because it is grimy.
Wait, did I say Joy-Cons? I meant to say Nunchucks. That's the one. Yeah, not Joy-Cons. <laughs> oh. I actually also found my Xbox 360 box, but that was uh, that was tattered beyond keeping. Basically, that was just ripped to shreds. Sadly, um, but no, I'm, I'm glad I got my Wii back. And I found some very old crap Wii games, which I might... Uh, well, it's always good to have old weird games. Getting a plane ticket overseas is going to be a nightmare. <laughs> no, but it's worth it. It's worth it, though. I mean, the Wii console is a little bit dirty, but it has got the stand. It's got a little silver stand, or grey stand with it. Got the, the Nintendo power adapter. It's got the, it ha okay, it's got the um, sensor bar, but it is one that my dog bit into. So I don't think one side of it really works. So what you have to do is stick it on your on your telly, and then just light one candle, <laughs> put the one candle at the edge. That all that is bound to work. Trust me, trust me. You've got a. Do you got a Modern Warfare 2 Xbox 360? I didn't even know they did that. I mean, it doesn't surprise me, but... Xbox 360, Modern Warfare 2. Oh. Oh, it's a black one. Oh. You know, that's actually a really interesting... Well, not interesting, but something I just thought of is... The whole thing with the, um, oh, hang on, you can't see. Uh, the whole thing with the PS5, right, is that it's got the, the plates that you can customise. How many, have they even done that yet? Like, how many plates have they even done? I'm talking, like, official ones, because I'm sure there's loads of third third-party ones. But, um... Have they even done that? I don't know. Official. I think there's a sp yeah, there's a Spider-Man one coming out soon. But I mean, I guess yeah. We just get them from Etsy or whatever, or just plain colored ones. Oh my god, Google took pictures of my 360. <laughs> I may get the original Xbox and 360 from Amazon in the future. Right now I can't because I have no money. That's fair. I would say, to be fair, um, list of games, list of Xbox games that work on Xbox 360. There's actually a fair number that do. So I don't know if you really need an original Xbox. It depends on the games you want to play. But um Oh, forward compatible as well. But yeah, there's there's actually quite a lot. I didn't realize just how many worked. Obviously I knew that um Where is it? Destroy humans. There you go, because that's how I did the let's play. I um I played on my 360. And what was the other one I played? Future Armor. Future Armor also worked. There. This is tiny for you, isn't it? There you go. I think that... Oh, Stubbs a Zombie. I think that one worked, because that's how I played that. No, I didn't. I played that on PC. But I think it does. Don't know why I remember that for. <gasps> Simpsons Hit and Run. Significant screen tearing. Yeah. Oh, Sphinx. Yeah, that's how I played that as well, Sphinx, even though I never finished that Let's Play. There you go, Stubbs a Zombie. If you have the right hard drive. Oh, okay, I didn't know it was about hard drives. <clears throat> yeah, I, that is one thing that I think is quite good. 
that's actually why I was tempted at one point to get a um like a cheap is it Series S was the cheap one? Um because I think that had quite good backwards compatibility, although I guess it's saying the Xbox One here. Um Sphinx got wait what? Sphinx got a port to the current consoles. I knew about Stubbs, but I did not know about Sphinx. Or did I? I'm old and forgetful. Hmm. I actually I played this whole game because I, I like yeah I started let's playing it so I played the whole thing to to learn about it and it's actually a really good game it's really long it's really long but some of the puzzles are actually I remember one room in particular was really good um yeah if it if it had voice acting I think that would have sealed the deal if it had voice acting this would have been a really strong a really strong game. Um, I think the lack of voice acting does kill it a little bit, but the actual gameplay itself is still really good. Just a lot of that's why it made for a bad let's play in the end because I had to just I had to read everything out and I just got tired. <laughs> I just got tired of reading. Um. Anyway. Anyway. Series S was cheaper because it was digital only. Yes. Okay. So it was that one that I was looking at. Oh, the hardware is worse in Series S. Oh. Oh, it was on Switch. Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy Switch. Oh, wow. Would you look at that? Actually, I do recall it now. I do recall this, but... Did they add voice acting? <laughs> Probably not. Um... 2699 come on sorry I, I keep i keep tabbing off and then 20 that's just no no i mean i get it i guess but no 2019 oh wow anyway back to the factory we're now on our own so Can I can I open this box now? Aha. Uh -huh. I'll have that. Thank you very much. The wine? It's a miniature bottle of <gasps> red wine with a screw cap. Oh yes. Very classy. Oh yes, this is that. This is my sort of game now. Why is my Windows nightlight thing turned on? There we go. A miniature bottle of red wine. Can we make that look like blood? Ooh! Well, if we mix that with the wafer? Hmm, that won't work here. Okay. What was the other thing that we could do? Oh, yeah, this one. Up here. For some reason, Star Wars Jedi Survivor is being ported to PS4 or Xbox One. Really? I guess there's always that that period of uh, supporting both console um, generations, but I don't know. Even like the PS5 is is when did the PS5 come out? It feels like that was quite a few years ago now. Was it 2019 or 2020? 2020. Okay. I mean, that's three years old now. PS4 must have been... 2016? I really don't know. I'm, I'm looking it up right now. 
2013. Oh my god. Holy moly. <laughs> I did not realize it was that old. That's crazy. Right, what was I doing? Oh yeah, turning this. I can just see into the mixing machine. Large blades are spinning and mixing a fresh batch of dough. Ah, let's stick the wine in here. I think I had the right idea. I was just doing it to the wrong thing. There we go. I'm a naughty, 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 naughty health inspector. Now all I have to do is let it work its way through. Oh, you naughty health inspector, you. Oh, better close that. I'm not going to stick my hand in there. I figure they aren't interested in new lines, especially not finger flavor. <laughs> you could call it finger food. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> what is this going to do? This is going to make all the wafers red. And that looks bad. Now then, Sister Serena, the next batch is ready. I'm sure you appreciate perfection, Mr. Steiner. Oh, yes, but I rarely witness it. Outside my own bailiwick, of course. Bailiwick? Bless you. Hmm. Mm. Well, here we go. The next batch of classic wafers. Oh, my. Oh, dear. So this is the color of perfection? Uh, 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 but how, how, how could this happen? Two little words, Sister Angelica. Sloppy maintenance. But that machine is cleaned every day. In this case, it would seem cleanliness is not next to godliness. I have no choice but to close this place down. Please, no. We have a large order to complete. Such a shame I was not made more welcome. Oh, Mr. Steiner, there must be something we can do. One so rarely hears the word sorry these days. Wouldn't you agree, sister? Sorry? Oh, I see. Mr. Steiner, I am very sorry for this terrible lapse. Hmm. Hmm. With feeling? Very, very <laughs> sorry. Well, I suppose if you can fix it now, then I might overlook the issue. But it has to be spotless. <laughs> of course. You make yourself comfortable and we'll knuckle down to it. Yes. Yes, please do. I wonder what kind of accent the German voice actor puts on this scene. Mm. Maybe they'd do like a silly British accent instead. Let's go. Bye, sister. Hey, sister. Bye, sister. Uh oh. Crates. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay then. Well, we'll move those in just a second. Let's see. Ah. Okay. Whoa, George, calm it. Damn, the gate's locked. And I don't like the idea of climbing over it. Not with those spikes. Locked. No. Nope. No point in trying. No, go down. Down. Down, George. Can I fall off the stairs? I did. Wow, that's great. Right, so we need to be able to climb up there, and we do that. Oh, wait. 
Oh, we don't move the crates. Oh, that's that's no fun. Well, actually, no, I prefer that. But I thought we might have to move the crates. Nope. Up. Oh, no, is this a stealth section again? <gasps> it's going to be stealthy, isn't it? You found a let's play. He has an e a bit more whiny. That's impossible. Damn, gardens full of monks. That's an unplayable game. I can't. I can't handle that much whiny German. I can only handle wine. Uh, save. All right. Let's just deal with these monks head on. Okay, no, put this put the knife down. Uh oh, there's that oh they look scary like that. There's one up there as well. Let's go this way. Okay, that one needs to move. Hey, you're not supposed to be here. Gobs! How do you know that? I'm the health inspector, I'd have you know. Oh. Oh, we can... Okay. All right, then. We can go up here. Oh, can we... Can we... Hello, don't mind me. Just gonna go in here behind you. Hey you! What are you doing here? Guards! Okay. That was just practice round. Let's see here. A fine native Italian shrub. Is he going to say that about all of them? A fine native Italian shrub. Fine leather jackets. No. So that's the door we need to get through. Okay. But that one sees us. We need to distract this one. Oh, we need... No. Oh, we can't go that side because that guy's going to see us. And this guy is not moving. What a shrub. My name is Mr. Hey, you! Oh. You can't come in here! Guards! I've been spotted by nearly every single one of them. Hey, you! You can't come in here! Guards! I'm just testing the line of sights here. Don't mind me. I'm just, uh, you know, trying things out. What if I wear this? Can I pretend to be one? How do we still get the mouldy bread? I don't know. I guess we didn't use all of it. Locked. No point in trying. Can we go in there? No. Right, well, oh, can we climb that pipe? No. Don't look at me. Hey, you! You can't come in here! Guards! Don't look at me. I feel like this was quite a good little path up here. Until we got spotted. 
Why, can I just try and talk to them? Can I just try and reason with them? Hey, you! You can't come in here! Oh, for goodness no. sake. Okay. I must be missing something then. How about over here? Oh, no, George. No, George. Where are you walking? Stop walking that way. Oh, for goodness sake. Hmm. Oh, that guy's going to see me. Hey, you're not supposed to be here. Gobs. I don't believe that line of sight. I don't actually think he could see us there. I think that's fake. I think that's a fake thing. All right. Do I have anything on my phone? This is usually those situations where I forget my phone does something and then... Uh... No. Hey, you, get out of here now. <laughs> George just goes back in the bushes like Homer. I know, I do, I do, I am quite, I'm just impatient like that. I keep running everywhere. And that caught me off guard before, didn't it? Let's just try walking then. Oh, it was that stupid, the stupid guard in the Pasha Palace. Okay, just stop. Click and stop. There we are. Let's see if this does the trick. Yeah, I was just thinking, he's still going to see me, though, even if I don't run. Hey, you're yeah. not supposed to be here. Okay. Gobs. So you really can't get... It's going to have to be the other side, then. Although, I mean, looking at it, he could still really look forward. So... Where do I go then? I can't go around that way. Is it definitely not something to do with those? The fact that the inside of that building is rendered makes me think I can go in there. But no, there's definitely no... There's no interactive thing there, is there? I guess Nico's appearance was just a cameo. Oh, yeah. Why do, they, why do they hate Nico so much in this game? Oh, hanging with Archie? Oh, dear. I feel bad for Nico, then. Hey, you! You can't come in here! Oh, will you Go. just bugger off, all right? Can you just... Straight to hell with you. Can I push one of these plants as a distraction or? Oh, the birds. Oh, that, wow, that was actually the right idea. What? <laughs> I 
<laughs> wow. Okay. And then get away. Is that going to distract them? Maybe I should have done it to that one. Because, yeah, why would we still have the bread? It's got to be for a reason. We still have the bread. Because we still need to use the bread. Let's throw it on this one. Then run over here. Yes. Yes, okay, great. Don't mess this up, Joe. Hey, you! Oh, for... You can't come in here! Guards! Alright, it's fine. I know what to do now. Broke up one or two had less than eco scenes before they did the director's cut. Yeah, that is true. That's why it always sounds so different when it switches back to George and those older ones. Like the sound quality just takes a, a beat in. Right, do that. Dumb monk. Dumb muck, more like. Ooh. And then actually, let's save here. Right, just wait. Just wait it out. Here we go. <gasps> oh. Hey you! No, I was you there. Can't come in here. Guards. Oh, damn you. I was there. Screw you. Deku Palace. Can't say I know what that's like. I'm assuming it's a Zelda thing. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, I think I need to be a bit more hot on his tail because I think he turns. Oh, go, go, go. Oh, hallelujah. The right place, place to say that as well, isn't it? Right, save. I'm not doing that again. Wait, is there still guards? Oh, uh, monks. <laughs> guards. <laughs> I mean, they effectively are. There's no way I'm going to be able to open those doors with a beam across. Grandpa Stobart's hernia made family history, and I'm not about to join him in the honors. Thank you, Dennis. Thank you. Uh, you also have to sneak past guards in both Zelda 64. That bit, I do I do get that bit. That's like that's probably the furthest I've ever got in... <laughs> which is just not far at all. <laughs> in Ocarina of Time. I really just did not devote any time to that game. <laughs> Ugh. That thing isn't going to budge. I wonder what they're keeping down there. Have we got any oil? Or anything oily? Salami might be pretty oily. No way am I doing that. Alright, well, I thought that was a good idea. You clearly uh, do not. There's definitely someone here, isn't there? I hear footsteps. It's kind of creeping me out, actually. Oh, no. Oh, I like the windows. Oh, this is where we were just walking past. Yeah, there's a door. Okay, they're, they're going to see me in here, aren't they? 
Oh, no. The door's either very heavy or just locked. I'm sure it's the latter. Jackpot. Jackpot missed the doorway. Yep, yep, if we could just... Mmm, plush. I'm in the wrong business. An interesting taste in paintings, too. Mmm. Right, well, we made it in to somewhere, at least. But I think with that, I'm going to call it there. Here's a slightly shorter stream, but I need to go eat food. I haven't had any dinner yet, and I'm starving. All that talk of pizza did not help. And I could, I could even eat a communion wafer right now. I really could. The werewolf pope. He's fine during the day. Um, okay, so yeah, that is going to do it for tonight's stream. We actually made some decent progress, albeit with a smidge of cheating. But you got to do what you got to do. Why is that not showing? There you go. Um, so yeah, thank you everyone for stopping by and chatting this evening. Pleasure as always. Sorry it was a bit late, but here we are. That's just the way things are. Um, as I mentioned in the update video last week, well this week, um, got a new Let's Play starting of Voodoo Detective. And I think the first part, probably tomorrow, thinking about it. Just trying to like schedule things in my head. Probably the first part coming out tomorrow. Um, then we've got some Monkey Island, Sea of Thieves. Uh, and then I don't know, maybe some Simpsons. We shall see. Those red wafers did look pretty good. Listen, anything wine flavoured, I'll eat them. Uh, Nico will return eventually. Good. Good. Cookie delivery? Where did you come from? <laughs> Hello and goodbye. Thanks for thanks for joining us. Okay, yeah. So yeah, I'll um I'll see you all this time next week for another live stream. Maybe some more broken sword. Maybe something else. Maybe we'll break it up next week. But yeah, stay tuned for the videos coming out this week. Let's plays and Monkey Island, all that good stuff will return. So yeah, that's gonna do it. Thanks everyone. See you next time. Bye bye. Hello, John.